Hi, uh, this is Hung. We're at uh, uh, Neptune's Net, yeah. and uh, he's got a, a live wire one. He's done some modifications to want to talk to him about it. Uh, first of all, I see you've got the carbon wheels. Yeah. Uh, tell me the story. Where'd you get those? What uh, they cost? How'd you put them on? So they're from stuff. a company called BST. They're in South Africa. Right. Uh, it took about five months to get, including shipping and customs. Wow. And it costs about. I don't know, about five thousand, five grand, five grand, and um, plus uh, you know, a cost for ceramic bearings. You got ceramic bearings. Yeah. So did you have to get them pushed out of the wheel, or did it come already installed? In the um, wheel? so it came with normal bearings, right. and I ordered ceramic bearings here myself here in the U.S. Right. Um, so, so, you, so you had to push them in. Yeah. So you took them to a shop somewhere. Or you had I, your I own puller. Right? No, I took it to a shop and um, okay. they did the whole thing. Um, okay. You know. How did you get the front end in the air when you were putting the wheel on? How did they put it? Yeah, like how'd you lift it up to get the wheel off? Oh, I have no idea. That shop did it. Oh, the I, shop I dropped it off, and then oh, okay. I just had it towed there, and then okay. doing your magic, and oh, yeah. okay, and then go back. Yeah, so, I'm pretty sure they have a lift, but shop lift. Okay, I also see you've got the carbon uh, yeah. cover here on the light. Yeah, so that's this is a, the Harley. That's uh, the Harley aftermarket. item. Yeah, this aftermarket Harley item. Okay, now uh, where are the turn signals on the bike? I see the top. Uh, the top so the these bike. are the. Um, daytime running lights. Oh, okay. And the turn signals are here. So when I turn. Now, is is that a live wire part or is that? I haven't seen that before. No, it's from a company, a uh, German company. German and, company. Um, they have an office location in Northern California, too. I forgot okay. the name of it. But, okay. Um, but in terms of the wiring, it's uh, it comes yeah. off. Yeah. The wiring oh, okay. Here, and so then I found my own plugs. I just made my own plugs. Made my own plugs. Plug and play. Okay. Um, and then. Yeah. I see you're running the mirrors under the bars. Yep. So that's obviously just for better visibility. Um, no, it's fine for me. Okay. Yeah, I can totally do it. Okay. Yeah. And uh, I notice you went with the grips. Are these live wire grips or yeah. Harley grips? These or? are uh, live, um, Harley live wire Rizoma. Okay. Yeah, Rizoma grips. Okay. Um, Rizoma. Is this a mod here too? Yeah, Rizoma, Rizoma um, cover. Okay, cover. cool. Now, is this the stock seat? This is the lower seat, Harley lower seat. Oh, okay. Lower. Okay, is that, okay, I have never seen that before. So that's a, that's a, that's a live wire Harley item. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, me too. Um, <laughs> and so, this is also the so that's the uh, Harley uh, Rizoma. Okay. Now, I, I see you've, you've got the license plate under the bike. How did you, how'd you get uh, Is that a kit or is that? Yeah, so I 3D printed these. 3D printed? Yeah, 3D printed. Uh, okay, oh, all right. Tail lights and the uh, lights cover. So is that something you designed yourself? I designed and 3D printed it. Uh, how, big a, how big a 3D printer do you need? Like a six, six inch or nine inch? Uh, for this one, not too big. Maybe like 12 by six. Okay, yeah. that's pretty cool. So uh, then what you do, how'd you get the lights to work here? Is that, uh, yeah, did you have to wires? rewire the whole bike? You ran no. the thing yeah, just ran it here. Um, I originally had it under the seat, which I'll put it back when I got okay. it back for party. I don't know why they put it out down here. Now, did you have a problem with the ring the light slashing? No, everything, everything worked fine. Everything worked fine. Okay. Yeah. And you don't, so this thing, how'd you take that out? I see you pulled it. I, I didn't even know that came out. Problem. Okay, yeah, that's I cool. I had the dealer take this piece off. All right. So did you? Did you? Uh, is that cut off? Did you cut it off? No, no. It's just a bracket. It's just a bracket. Yeah, oh, okay. 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 Yeah. All right. Yeah. yeah. But this side, I, you know, I kept it. So I keep it oh, off. you have a modification here too. Yeah. So, so what did you do here? You took. This is a cover. I mean, this is a bracket for. Uh, okay. The bell guard. Okay. Yep. And then the uh, rear wheel. Uh, do you have carbon bearings in that as well? Ceramic bearing. No. Or ceramic no, it's bearings. Just a normal bearing. Okay. Yeah. Now, how much weight have you been able to take off the wheels? Um, so it's five pounds in the front, right? Uh, six pounds in the rear. Okay, <clears throat> and that's uh, that's uh, ro rotating mass too. Yeah. And then here, where where did this come from? Uh, this is I designed this too, 3D okay. printing, uh, custom vendor. All right. Cool. Yeah. Very nice. All right. Well, hey man, it's a really sweet looking bike. Oh, oh I just noticed it hasn't. You've got you've got Diablo. Tires on yeah, it. Yeah, the Apple Supercourse uh, 200. Really? Uh, oh, you went to a 200 size? Yeah, 180 to 200. Oh, man. Yeah. Did you get okay clearance on the belt? Everything clears? Everything clears. Yeah. 
a lot of clearance. It's, yeah, it's not bad. I didn't notice that. So how does that feel? Did you do the tires and the wheels at the same time? No, I did the tires first. So did that make a difference by itself? Um, I, I noticed it grips better on the turn. Really? Um, and then with the wheels, it's just more, the bike's more nimble. Okay. A lot more nimble. Do you have any other mods you're going to do for the bike in the future? Um, I think I'm pretty much done. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm done. I don't know what else to do to it. I mean, do you have I've other already... bikes too? Do you have gas bikes? Yeah, or... I have uh, Indian Scout Bobber. Okay. And I just bought a Ducati Panigale B4S. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So... You bought the 2022? 2022. That's the one where they fixed the frame problems, right? The other ones had handling problems. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm not had... sure. That's my first sports yeah, bike. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay cool. I'll probably die on it, but cool. yeah. <laughs> so, um, do you have you ridden this in the canyons much? Uh, I used to, yeah. I haven't. Okay. I haven't with these wheels. I just got the uh, bike back like a couple days oh, ago. Oh, okay, so you haven't had a chance. I haven't had a chance. Maybe on the on the way back we could do it. <laughs> maybe. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, okay. if I have enough range. <laughs> right. Well, thanks very much for your time. Yeah, really cool bike. Yeah, no problem. All right.